dun dun bam that's me how's it going guys it's token vaping so today's juice review unfortunately and sadly yes is the final flavor in a line that i had the extreme pleasure and opportunity of being able to do reviews for they are based out of los angeles california and just great great people overall uh, great company but flavors are have always been rock solid and on point you know they may not be for everybody but everybody's a little different so but there is a bunch of different variations to try from so without further ado i'm going to jump into the flavor we're going to do a vape we're going to do a cloud check and then i will go into the information about the company itself but it is hype city vapors and the final flavor we are doing today is apple pie and as you can see it does have a stout security ring as most companies are going with nowadays this is meant to be straight up an old-fashioned apple pie with uh, apple slices and a sugary graham cracker crust. So, one thing I'm going to be looking for, obviously, is whether or not you can taste the crust. Because, unfortunately, with a lot of flavors, especially when there's supposed to be a crust flavor, that's the hardest part of that flavor to try to bring out or get somebody to be able to taste. So, this is going to be a question of whether or not is this taste like a home a home baked apple pie um, or what type of apple pie because there are a couple of different styles and types so we'll definitely check that out and I will let me know for sure and as always it is going on a fresh cotton wick as you always see here that I do for you guys which as always Texas Tough Cotton just works really well for me um, been using it for pretty much since the beginning of doing reviews and I'm just a big fan of it it's quick and easy to use, little to no break in time, and that's the selling point for me. But that link is always in the comment box if you are interested in trying it out. So we'll go ahead and pop that open. Okay, so on the first smell, it definitely smells like apples. Um, with a, It almost has a slight hint of a cinnamon kick to it, which I'm hoping stays slight. Unfortunately, I'm not a fan of cinnamon. Um, so... I'm hoping that it doesn't have too strong of a cinnamony taste. I do know a lot of people make apple pies that have cinnamon in them, but we will get to see how well this tastes. Now, honestly, I'm all for flavors tasting exactly like their counterparts. You know, that's to me, that's a sign of a good flavor. However, in this particular case, because this is meant to be a dessert or a pie, I really am hoping that it doesn't actually taste like apples. I want it to actually taste like an apple pie. I know that sounds kind of weird. Why would I want it to taste like an apple pie? But, you know, it's just one of those things. And I'm hoping that it it's not overtaken a whole lot either by cinnamon, by... A, ooh. Ooh. Now I really hope this tastes like the way it just smells. Because off the burn off, literally, that's like you just pull the pie out of the oven. That actually... Wow. I don't think I've ever stopped myself in mid-sentence like that. Huh. So I'm going to go ahead and cap this up, and as always, vaping at 75 watts for the review. This is Apple Pie from Hype City Vapors. I'm going to do a redrip. I've been starting to do this, but now I really want to do one. And I'm going to probably, if it sticks to this, I'm telling you right now, I'm going to give you a really corny explanation on this. And I'm just forewarning you. But I, I, know, I normally do this just to ensure that everything that I get out of the flavor is what's supposed to be there. And I'm not missing anything. I didn't overlook anything. Um, because the last thing I want to do is misinform anybody about what a flavor is supposed to taste like. So here's a quick second redrip. Okay, apple pie from Hype City Vapors. If you like apple pie, if you like desserts, if you like that type of flavor, I'm telling you right now, and here's the corny line. This flavor right now, just vaping it in the short amount that I just did, gives a holiday feel. Um, by that, I mean, usually, I mean, most people don't normally just bake an apple pie just because. Some people do. Um, but generally... You know, around the holidays, people put the extra time and effort in and they make, you know, all these desserts and the pies and stuff like that that they want, you know, everybody to enjoy. 
because of that homely feel that it gives, that holiday feel and things like that. This flavor actually reminds me of that feel. The, the smell of it off the burn off of it is, you know, if somebody just baked it, opened up the oven door and pulled that pie out of the oven, that's what you would smell. I still have a bit of an aftertaste of it that tastes like apple and cinnamon, but I don't mind it. And I just told you I, I'm not a cinnamon fan, but it's the taste is really enjoyable. Now, the only negative thing I can say about this, and again, and I stated this because it's a hard part of the flavor to pull out. The crust is a little hard to pull in, out of this flavor. Now, everybody does have a different sensitivity to flavors. Everybody has a different taste palette. So other people might be able to pull that out more than I can. The crust aspect of it really isn't as strong as I thought it might be. But because of the apple, the warm apple flavor, because of the little bit of a cinnamon hit that it has, because of the feel that you get off this vape, you almost don't miss it. On to be, At least I don't. Um, but it, this is definitely a rock solid flavor. Like I said, if you like desserts, if you like um, like the pie flavors and, and the heavier type flavors like that, you definitely need to check this out for an all day vape. It is from Hype City Vapors. They have their own website. It's HypeCityVapors.com. You can find out all the flavor profiles off that page. You can also order directly off that page. They are offered in 60 ml bottles such as this. And they do come in a nicotine of a 0, 3, and a 6. And as you saw, the cloud production is rock solid because it's an 80-20 mix ratio. So you're definitely going to get clouds. You're definitely going to get a smooth vape. No throat hit, but solid on flavor, especially apple pie. Um, but that's the label. And it's it's got you know a fun feel to it. The nicotine level's on top. The name of the company. The name of the flavor. Um, and then it has the 21 and over because it is based in California. And then it has their social media sites here with the warning and ingredient labeling here. Now, the other cool thing about this company is that, especially if you check out their website, it is all listed there. They do practice the GMP, which is good manufacturing process or procedures, which means that they do follow everything that, th that is required to be followed to ensure that you're getting a top premium quality line product. They also are an ISO certified um, company, which means that they use an ISO facility lab to manufacture and house and make this make this liquid, which means that, you know, it's a lab style facility, which means that the time and effort and attention to detail and cleanliness and everything is there as well. Their testing process is amazing as well. You know, they go through multiple testings of a flavor before they say, hey, you know what, we would vape this all day, we're going to go ahead and sell this. But definitely go and check them out. The box that it comes in basically is just an emulation of the bottle. Pretty much everything that's on the box, you'll find on the label as well. They are on Facebook. They are on Instagram. They are on Twitter. They have their website. You can email them directly as well. So there is no shortage of ways to contact them if you are interested. If you uh, frequent a shop, if you own a shop, if you work at a shop and you do not carry this line, definitely reach out to them. They will be more than happy to talk with you, explain to you uh, a bit about themselves. And it is a it is a great line just in general, overall across the board. And they have a couple of different unique style flavors that should accommodate most vapors. But definitely check them out. Hype City Vapors, I apologize that I'm done with your line, but it was a huge privilege and opportunity to be able to do the reviews that you sent me the bottles uh, solely for. As always, guys, I'm Token Vaping. I'm here on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and Pinterest. Anything that I can do myself to help further enhance your vaping experience and make it more enjoyable for you is the only reason why I do this. So definitely reach out to me and let me know if you have any questions, comments, concerns, a particular video that you'd like to see. I will do everything in my power to make that happen. But until next time, as always, I am continue to be humbled and honored by all your, all your support, all your views, all your likes, your comments, your constructive criticism, all of it. So definitely click that subscribe button, like and comment. It's definitely, it's definitely appreciated, and I always try to answer back to them when I see them. Till next time, guys. Always truly love yourself. Vape on, vape strong. Have a good one.